Welcome to Splash Games. Today we're going to be showing you the game Onitama. This game is two players, ages 14 and up, and fi around 15 minutes. I think you can play it with younger kids. It's a lot like chess, so if your kids know how to play chess, they can figure this out, even before they can play chess, because the rules are super simple. The game is a lot like chess with a board, and you're trying to get their king, but it's a lot shorter. But there's so much variety each time you play. Oh, it's such a great story. There's like these little cards that have different animals on it, which is pretty cool. I like that part. <laughs> and here's how you play. Okay, so here's the setup for Onitama. So, in order to win, you either have to capture the master of your opponent, or put your master on their temple arc spot. So there's two different ways to win. And the, the game rules are very simple. In each game we have five cards. There's two here, one on the side, and one on this side. And I can move any of my people using this black space in this direction. So I can go diagonal uh, to the left, or I could go two spaces to the left with one of my characters, or I can go back diagonally to the right side. So that's what that card says. So I can use that card, or I can use my Cobra card, which lets me move to the left, to the right, or the back. So let's say I use um, my frog, and I move one character, one character diagonally, if I use my frog, I put it here, and I grab the crane. Then the opponent goes, and you're going back and forth, and I can see exactly the spaces that my opponent can move, because I can see what his cards are. So I could put my student right here, because I can see on his cards that he can't go diagonally to the right. But once he uses a card, he might be able to eventually, so I have to keep an eye out for that. But I can see exactly what moves he has, and he can see exactly what moves I have. And the game is just really quick, but it's super strategic. And there's a whole pile of different cards, so each time you play a game, you'll be playing with different cards. So the whole strategies will change every time. And when you get, when you capture their master or you get your master on their temple then you win. The components to this are really amazing because this play mat is just so great. It's not a board but it's a mat and it's just really durable and the box that they all come in is just really cool so I just I love how the game looks and the components of it. And that's how you play Onitama. Onitama.